I'm Brittany and I'm Brianna and, and welcome, welcome back to the Lewis Twins channel. So this is going to be part two of yesterday's video, which if you did not watch yesterday's video, go watch it and check it out. We are going to be continuing on with fall essentials and fall staples that you need in your wardrobe, but this time we are going to be doing bottoms, shoes, and accessories. So if you want to see what fall bottom shoes and accessories, we suggest you get in your fall wardrobe. Then keep on watching. So now we are going to be doing dresses now, and this is a dress that we got from H&M in the size small. I think that this is so so cute and I really love this bow design here and also like how the sleeves and like the rest of the dress is like in fringe and this white material I think it is super cute ribbons are always giving fall to me I don't know why when I saw this it was kind of giving me Wednesday Adams I think it would be really cute like if you did ribbons in your hair maybe did like some sheer tights I just really really like this dress and I really like this material it's like very lacy it's giving very much feminine and I normally don't like bodycon dresses but this is like a 10 out of 10 for me. Next is this cute brown dress from Target in a size small and I really do love this. Like everything about this is giving fall. Just the color and like the detailing. I actually did go back to see if they have like some other colors and they do. They have black and green I think but they don't ever have my sizes so I definitely want to go back and get a black one. I would just definitely wear it as is or you can always just throw a jacket on it if it's a little cooler outside and some tights and it'll be super cute that way as well. So the next one is a very long dress. This is from Zara in the size small this is just fancy you cannot really make this more casual i don't think maybe if you like threw like a sweater over it like i was talking about earlier and then just use this to be like a long maxi skirt but i don't know i don't know how i feel about this like i was saying earlier like i don't really wear bodycon yeah this is why because i don't really like how i look in this dress overall somebody that does like bodycon i think this is a really cute dress and like the material is like very slick it's not very gonna be very warming but it's definitely gonna be great for like layering to have this as a base if you want to throw a sweater over it like i just mentioned so if you like bodycon dresses i would definitely go pick Zara. So I got this one when I went to the Pretty Little Thing pop-up shop a couple blocks ago. So if you haven't seen that, go check it out. But it finally did come in and I showed that also in the video. And then this is it on. This is super cute. It's this cream colored romper in a size small. I think it's definitely giving fall, but be warned that it's very see-through. So I'm going to be careful of that when I wear it. I think this is definitely cute for running errands with some slides or like some sneakers or something. And you can also wear this as a bodysuit and put jeans over it. I just really do think that this is a nice versatile fall staple for my wardrobe this next one we got from burlington and it is in a size small but i think it is super cute it's just like a sweater dress so that's what we're making it and i really like how it is white and black i think that it's super super cute and i definitely can see me wearing this either like to work or night out or just like during the day casual and we could probably also wear this as a shirt too if we want to with some jeans or something but i probably would most likely wear this as a dress with some knee-high boots or something and i'm just really obsessed with this and i just really love the thought of a sweater dress we really don't have many sweater dresses this season this is really the only one so i'm glad that we were able to find this and get our hands on this now we're going to be doing a few bottoms that we have in our fall wardrobe these black trousers for fall and they're from h&m and they're in a size four and i think that these are super cute they're very versatile i mean i wear them to work so they're good for like dressing up basic casual and i think you can also wear them casual if you would like to they're kind of like a baggier fit and they have like a wide leg and then the top is more high waist and it's kind of more cinching i think it's super cute and they have pockets like if you want to store stuff and just put your hands like in here to look cool so i definitely think that a pair of black trousers will be super cute for this fall season okay so next is a piece that is out of our comfort zone and it is these brown cargo Pants. These are from Burlington Coat Factory and they are in the size zero slash double zero. And I think that these are super cute. I haven't worn these yet, but I think I could definitely wear these. I mean, we brought them, so I definitely will style them and I do like them. I think they're cute. They have these pockets on the side and they're kind of like baggier and wide leg. I can definitely see myself wearing these and I'm also very excited to style these. So next is this super, 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 super cute mini plaid skirt from Zara and the size small. It is super, super cute. Plaid is screaming fall. This is a like navy blue and gray mini plaid skirt. This is so, so cute. I've literally been on the hunt for the perfect mini plaid skirt because most of the time I want to be like all the way like down here. But I think that this is super cute. 
and I really want to get a brown one too. I didn't see them have a brown one. I think they have this in plain black as well. But I really like this and I really like this belt that they did give. I wish they had like a few more buttons so I can make this like a little bit tighter like that instead of like hanging down like that. But that's like my only complaint with this. I think this is super, super cute and I'm so much a skirt girly for fall. Like give me a pair of tights and some boots and let's go. Skirts scream fall. So I'm really excited that we have quite a few basic type skirts for this fall season. Okay, so next is going to be this midi bodycon type maxi skirt. This is a size small and we got it from H&M. I think that it's super cute, like it's not full length. So like you can still wear it like when it's a little bit warmer for the fall seasons and definitely just a long skirt is definitely just screaming fall. There's a split down the middle, which I am okay with. I mean, I would kind of prefer it to be more on the side, but I guess the middle is fine. So I'm definitely going to think about the different ways to wear the skirt, maybe with like a bodysuit or you could probably throw a sweat on top of it and make it like a cute comfy cozy outfit either way i'm excited to get out of my comfort zone with these long skirts because i literally don't ever wear long skirts so i'm excited to experiment with them this fall so this next one is super cute this is from h&m in the size two and i have literally been on the hunt also for a black mini skirt because a lot of times they want skirts to literally be like the one we just showed you which that's cute too but like i also want one that is like fits my waist and that's also like cute and mini so i'm so glad that we found this one i've already worn this before i don't know i don't really know how to describe it it has like these like lines down the center which i think i really like that detailing it adds depth to it instead of just being like a plain pencil skirt because that's what we already have that so we wanted something different i'm really glad that we added this to our collection like i said i'm such a skirt girly for fall so i'm so excited to pair these with some boots that we have to show you later in this haul this is a skirt from H&M and I believe it is in a size small. I don't know though because we took the tag off. But this is so cute. This is like in the middle of the short one and like that really long one. It has a nice little slit on one side and I think this is so cute to be bundled up in with a sweater or something. And I think it's great to have different lengths of black skirts because black skirts are such a staple. You can pair them with a lot of different colors and then like different lengths, like depending on what you're feeling that day. I'm not normally like a skirt to these type of girl. So I'm like gonna be trying to use this and incorporate it because it is so cute. If you hear sirens and stuff, if you've been hearing sirens, I apologize. This is NYC during rush hour. So it's gonna be loud. We're gonna try to turn the noise down as much as we can. <laughs> I would definitely recommend going to H&M for skirts because basically all the skirts except for the one from Zara are from H&M and they have like a really great selection. Next is a skirt that we got from Amazon and it is a Levi skirt so we definitely will link it on the Amazon storefront if you want to check it out. But we got this in a size 26 and I think that it's a little big in the waist. I think we definitely could have sized down but we did get those button things where like you can like pin a button like here and then we can just like do it like that. So they'll be linked on our Amazon storefront. So the reason that we sized up was for the length. We read the Amazon reviews and like a lot of people were saying that like if you get true to size, it may be a little bit shorter than you would want it to be. If you're in doubt, just size up and then also order the buttons that I was just talking about. So you can just like adjust the waist how how you want to wear it. I think other than that, this is super cute. I think this is like one of my favorite washes for the fall time. Just this perfect blue wash. This is actually probably my favorite wash like of any type of jean anytime. But specifically for the fall, I think this specific wash pairs perfectly with black clothing. And I definitely am obsessed with the black and denim combination. I think it's cute for fall. This skirt will definitely be something that I'm wearing. I think it's the perfect length because some skirts, you know, are too short. Some are too long. I think that this one is the perfect length. It's like in the middle of my thigh. And I think it would be super cute maybe for like i don't know i'm thinking ahead maybe like for thanksgiving dinner you could have this with some boots and a cute like burgundy type sweater i don't know i think that would be super cute i give this a 12 out of 10. we also got this denim skirt from amazon as well this is like in a size small if i believe and it is like a little bit big in the waist but i like it to fit a little bit better than to be like crushing my insides i got it for the length too because i want to wear this to work and like if i have to bend over and pick something up i don't want it to be like everything on display but i think this is so cute and i wanted to get like a different wash for this one than the levi we got like a light and like a darker one which is perfect we can wear both next is a pair of light wash jeans from h&m and they're in the size 
for. These are a little bit more of a high-waisted jean. I think that these are super cute. The bottoms are like kind of baggy and then like the bottoms are kind of wide leg. You could definitely wear a sweater with this or like one of the bodysuits that we showed in a cardigan. Many different ways to wear this piece. I definitely think that some denim in your fall wardrobe is just essential. The next one is these really big pants that we got from Burlington. They were in the men's department so i don't even know what size these are but i'm holding them like this because we do have those buttons from amazon that we were telling you about so they would normally like fit like this but i think this is so cute like these big baggy pants for full i think it's giving like 80s movie so that's why we got them and i think this would be cute like paired with a sweater like once we get the button but i also really like this wash this is like a different wash than the other washes we have so i think it's nice to have like a bunch of different kinds of jeans and denims to choose from when picking outfits next is this pair of men's baggy jeans that we got from Burlington. These are also Levi's. I think that these are super cute. These ones are definitely not as baggy as the other ones. This wash typically isn't a wash that like I would typically grab, but I think they could be super cute for the fall season. They're kind of giving me scream, Halloween, very 80s movie. So the next pair of jeans is also from Burlington Coat Factory, and we also got them in the men's section, so that is also why I'm holding them like this. But this is probably my favorite wash ever. I know Brianna said that her other color was it. This color right here, whatever this color is, like I'm gonna grab these jeans every single time. I think that this color pairs perfectly with black, which is so funny. But I really do like these jeans and I have worn them before with the full and I know that it works. So I just want you guys to get like more like a full, like actual view of what it would actually look like. I think like shopping in the men's department is perfectly fine because they do have those buttons at Amazon. So like to, if you really want like a baggy, baggy, comfortable, don't want like something like squeezing your legs, I would definitely do that. But yeah, I really do like these pairs. And I really love that they're Levi's. We got Levi's for like $35 at Burlington. So like what in the world? But like these are so cute and I've already worn them and I just can't wait to keep wearing them because I'm like obsessed. So we are now going to be doing shoes. I just put this skirt on just so I can have like a neutral base and something that's like going to be high enough for the shoes but we're probably going to be starting off with these knee-high boots this is a little bit something different than what i would normally wear because they kind of have more of like a square toe but it was very hard to try to find like a faux leather knee-high boot so like this was like one of the ones that they had so i was like okay, i'm gonna grab it because i still want to be in the knee-high trend i think it's super cute and i really do like this and we went with like little heel because i want to be able to wear them to work but I think that this is super cute and I really, really, really do love the knee-high trend. So I'm so glad that I could get a part of it. The only thing I know that I need to do now is I need to run and try to find a brown pair. I know this. I know that. I don't have it yet, but this is what we have for now and I'm really happy with this purchase. Next are these vegan Ugg boots that we found from Etsy. So I'm going to tag them below. So we actually talked about these in our fall favorites video. So if you haven't seen it, then go check it out. The inside is not going to be as full as like an Ugg boot. You know, since we are vegan, we want to have vegan and cruelty-free things. So yeah, we got these and I think that they're pretty close to the real thing. They're super cute and we all got the ultra mini with the platform. And I think that they're just super cute to wear for the fall to kind of spice up a casual outfit so you just don't have to wear sneakers all the time and here they are in the black version they're the same as the other ones but they're just black so i think having different colors give different versatilities for outfits and different looks for outfits next is going to be these chelsea platform boots i think that these are so so cute we got these from amazon in a size seven and this was also kind of very hard to find a pair that was not leather but these are faux leather and i think that they're so cute i have worn these before i would say the only thing about them they're gonna crease like very easily but i think that is that like all boots like they just all like kind of crease like if you like have your foot a certain way i really like, wanted to get the platform so i can wear boots to work without like almost like, tripping and falling like when i'm walking to work i can also wear these in the winter and they'll keep my feet nice and warm with a nice thick pair of socks next are these brown loafer tight heels and we got them in a size 7 from Burlington and I think they're super cute. I typically wear these with a sock because when you're walking they kind of like rub up and down on your heel and they kind of give you a blister. Other than that I think they're super cute. I think they're wearable for like a walkable city like how we're in New York City. We can walk with these and not really hurt my feet too much other than what I just said. I definitely love these and I'm excited to wear these. 
The next pair that we have are from Burlington and they're in a size 7 and I think that they're super cute. I know that like ballerina flats are in trend. The only pair that we do have are these brown pair which I think are so cute and I really do like the gold trim. I feel like we wear a lot of gold jewelry so I feel like it'll just tie it all in with the outfit. I would probably either wear these like with a skirt or jeans but I really do think that flat shoes are essential especially if you live somewhere where you walk a lot. Next we have these really cute shoes from Burlington. These are Mary Jane platforms. I think that these are so cute and I think that these shoes literally scream fall to me. I don't know why they like remind me of like shoes that you would wear going to like some private witch prep school or something. I don't know. It's giving me school vibes. I don't know. I think that these are super cute and we've worn these quite a bit. These actually did come with silver charms on them which I think is really cute. But yeah, I would normally wear these with socks or something but I really am like obsessed with these shoes and they did hurt my feet at first but like now that I'm used to them like I think they like stretch out a little bit so they don't hurt as bad like my feet. Feel pretty good in them. I think that they just really flatter the foot and I just really like wearing them with skirts or anything or like even probably jeans maybe. I don't know. I just really love these shoes and I'm so glad we got them. And I know I said that about every shoe that we got but like <laughs> these are probably like in the top three. Okay, so we only have one accessory and it's going to be these ribbons. We got them from Amazon and they have a bunch of different colors, but this is the pack that we got, this cream white type color and then these pink colors. Brittany wore these in her hair the other day, so we're going to insert a photo. I think that these are super cute and they kind of add like a feminine autumn vibe to any outfit. You can just go ahead and just put it, wear your hair half up, half down. These ones kind of have the clamp on it, so it may kind of be weird to like put it at the ends of braids. So I wouldn't suggest doing that, but I definitely suggest just putting it in your hair if you do like half up half down maybe you could do it if you get a ponytail that may look better but like i wouldn't put it on the ends of braids but i think that these are super cute and they come in different colors and they will be on our amazon storefront so if you want to get these you can go ahead and check those out okay so that is going to be it for today's video we want to thank you so much for watching and we also want to know what clothing pieces you think are essential in a fall wardrobe so comment that down below and if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video and we'll see you tomorrow with another day of vlogtober bye, bye.